Uh, today I will like to explain you about the fuel oil auto backflush filter and how it works. So in this picture you can see a lot of oil over here. Uh, actually what happened, why the oil is here because after backflushing also the oil was not getting drained. Because the drain system was not working. So I have opened both the candle filter here and here. And uh, I have changed over the uh, system to manual filter and try to backflash it. But uh, since the system was not working, so you can see the oil over here. So you can see the hole over here, this hole, through which the oil will come and go to the overflow tank through this pipe. Uh, we have a air cylinder here, which I have removed, I will show you. I will run the video for you, so that you will understand better. So you can see this is a purifier room and uh, I have removed the, this is a chamber uh, filled with air, we got a solenoid wall here, this is the hole through which the oil will come out when you are backflashing it. So this is the system, this is the ram which will move in and out when you are backflashing it, there are o-rings here, this will move inside and when you are giving a signal this will come out so at that time it will backflash so once it is in that means it, it is open and when it is out that means it is closed you can see this the hole this hole will be get closed it means no oil will go and when you are backflashing it the hole will open and drain the dirty oil you can see this is the line air line and this is the solenoid wall used for the backflashing so I will be showing you in more detail the drawing also here. You can see the oh, this is the one. This is the uh, spas used to be used here, and this o-ring is to be placed here. This is so dirty here, it's not working. Then you got an o-ring here, and you got an o-ring inside this also. This is the drawing here. You can go through the drawing. This is ball filter drawing. So you know which are the spas to be changed. You can see here there's a hole here. This whole air will be passing when the solenoid signal is given and uh, at the same time when you give the signal the opposite direction the piston will move and keep it closed. So while auto backlash flashing what happens is this piston will move for a second and open the way to uh, go the dirty oil into the overflow tank. This is, this is how it is. This is normally kept closed when the signal is given.